Germs Are Not For Sharing, written by Elizabeth Verdick. What are too small to see, but can have the power to make you sick? Germs, they're in the air, in your food and water, on your body, and in all the things you touch. But not all germs are bad. Still, germs are not for sharing because germs can make you sick. Achoo, achoo, what do you need to do? Cover your nose with a tissue before the germs get out. Blow, wipe, and toss. Cough, cough, cough. What do you need to do? Cover up your mouth before the germs get out. Like this, or this, or even this. If you cough or sneeze into your hands, hurry up and wash them because germs are not for sharing. When germs get on your hands, they can spread to other people. When you hold hands or play games, or give each other high fives. Whenever you touch something, your germs can get left behind and might even pick up new ones. Here are some places where germs can hang out. On your doorknob, on the cell phone, on your keyboard or mouse, even on your shoes or your game system controllers, in the toilet, on your puppy or dogs, and even on that carousel at the mall. Germs, germs everywhere. What can you do? You can wash your hands, use warm water and lots of soap, and scrub, scrub, scrub. Wash for as long as it takes to sing the ABCs or happy birthday, twice. Scrub the tops, scrub your palms, wash under your nails and even on your wrists. Now rinse, rinse, rinse. Send those germs down the drain. Bye-bye germs. And make sure to use a clean towel to dry your hands. Ten good times to wash your hands before you eat after you eat, after you sneeze, cough, or blow your nose, after rubbing your eyes, after picking your nose, after playing outside with the pets, after counting your coins, after crying, after using the bathroom, and whenever they're dirty. That's 10 good times to wash your hands, one for each finger, all clean, 